What is going on guys? Today I'm going to be showing you how to get custom icons on your iOS 14 device. So the first thing you're going to want to do is head to the description of this video, click on the link, and it'll take you to this page over here. Each of these icons are theme packs. They come with different types of icons. So we're going to go to the most popular section and we're going to look at some of the most popular icons. So these are the most popular icons right now. We're going to choose dark icons because honestly, it looks really good. Quick heads up guys, make sure you're using Safari to download this icon pack, otherwise it won't work. So once we've clicked dark icons, we want to click application icons. And this will just bring up a list of all the icons that is included in this pack. So we're going to want to select them one by one, just like I'm doing right now. And once we're done selecting, we're going to want to click generate theme and download the profile. Once the profile downloads, we want to go into settings, general, scroll down to profiles, and there you'll find the theme. Now we're going to tap on the theme, tap install, put in our passcode, and then tap install again. So now that we have the theme installed, we can go back to our home screen. And as you can see, we now have these icons. But I want to show you guys a little trick because when you click these icons, it goes through shortcuts. So there's a little bit of interference. Uh, it goes from one app to the other. I'm going to show you guys how to make it go straight to the app you want. So to do that, all you guys have to do is go into settings. Then you want to head to accessibility, head to motion, and then check reduce motion. Anyway, guys, that is how to get iOS 14 custom icons. If I helped you out or if you enjoyed the video, please like and subscribe and comment down below which icon pack is your favorite. I'm still trying to get to know more of them and I want to have the perfect iOS 14 home screen.